The next system of our body is nervous system. Nervous system consists of nerves and specialized cells called as neurons. Our nervous system is divided into the following central nervous system and peripheral nervous system. Let's learn about central nervous system. Central nervous system consists of three major parts, the brain, the spinal cord and the nerves. Let's learn more about brain. Brain is the major organ of a human body. Our brain helps us to think, read and write. The brain is covered by three membranes called meninges. The brain is protected by a bony case called skull. Human brain is divided into three major parts, cerebrum, cerebellum, medulla oblongata or brain stem. Let's learn about the parts of the brain. Cerebrum. It is the center of human memory. It is the largest part of the brain. It is responsible for intelligence, imagination and reasoning. Cerebellum. It helps to maintain the balance of the body and coordinates the movement of the muscles. It lies behind the cerebrum. Medulla oblongata. It is also called as brain stem. It connects the brain to the spinal cord. It controls breathing, heartbeat and other involuntary muscles. Now let's move on to the next system that is peripheral nervous system. Peripheral nervous system consists of nerves extending from the spinal cord to all parts of the body. It is made up of two parts, somatic nervous system and autonomous nervous system. Somatic nervous system. Somatic nervous system carries sensation from the organ to the brain and takes message from the brain to the organ for movement. Autonomous nervous system. It controls the nerves of the inner organs of the body. I hope now you know the importance of our organ systems.